Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. I hope you all are fine and staying safe and happy. I am your GK teacher, Ms. Farheen, and I welcome you all to your GK class. My dear students, as you know that we are on unit number 15, and the name of our unit is Flowers, Fruits, Seeds, and Fruits. So today we are going to talk about development of new plants through other parts of plants. Because we had in previous lecture mein two mods that we can new plants jo hai, wo grow kar sakte hai. Pehla jo hai, humne in detail discuss kiya tha, which was by seeds. Today we will discuss the second mod which is through other parts of plant, uh, new plants can also develop. So, but before moving on towards the lecture, let's quickly recap what we did in the previous lecture. For that, listen to the questions very carefully and then answer. How plant, uh, how new plants develop from seeds? Naye paude jo hai, wo seeds se kaise develop hote hai? When you sow the seeds into the ground, they have all the characteristics of the parent plant. Or uske baad, when they got the, get the conditions which are necessary for the growth of a plant, they germinate into a new plant. Okay. So, in today's lecture, students will be able to recognize that some plants grow from, this is also done, al already done, seeds. Today, we are going to discuss about other grow, uh, grow from other parts of the plant like stem and roots. So, Pauda jo hai, wo seeds ke ilawa kaise dousre hisso se, jaysay ke tane se aur jado se bhi ban sakta hai, we are going to discuss in today's lecture. So my dear students, let's quickly move forward towards the Islamic perspective. So Abu Huraira reported Allah's messenger, Hazrat Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam as saying, he who is presented with a flower should not reject it for it is light to carry and pleasant in odor. So pre-reading question, quickly tell me that do you know about grafting? Have you uh, seen buds on potatoes? So, my dear students, kya aapko grafting ke baare mein pata hai? What is grafting? Agar nahi pata to I will discuss, we will discuss it now. Kya aapne potatoes ke upar kabhi buds dekhe hai? They are slightly black in color. Kisi bachche ne dekhe ho? Raise your hand. Very good. Agar aapne dekhe hai, today we are going to discuss ki kaise in different parts se jo hai, wo ek naya plant grow ho sakta hai. So let's move forward towards the reading, just may have detail may discuss karenge, ki kaise dousre parts of your plant, plant hai, wo grow hote hai into a new plant. So I request you all to please open the second mod, which is through other parts of plants. I hope everybody has done it. Now let's move forward. Some plants do not need seeds to develop new plants. Some plants do not need seeds. Yani ke har paude ko, Beech ki zarurat nahi hoti naya pauda banne mein. So, wo kaise naya pauda banta hai? Let's discuss. Their parts have the ability to make new plants. Unke parts hote hain, jinke andar ye ability hoti hai, jisse wo ek naya pauda mein tabdeel ho sakte hain. So, the stem of rose plant develops into a new plant. So, agar aap ek stem le, yani ke unko cuttings kaha jata hai, rose plant ki, and you put it into the soil, it will grow into a new rose plant. Branches from two rose plants are tied together and sewn into the soil. It is called grafting. Agar aap do separate rose flowers ki branches ko le aur unko join kar de together, uh, you tie them together and put them into the soil. This is called grafting. Main aapko aage grafting ki picture bhi dikhati hoon. So you will have a clear picture that what is grafting. It starts growing and ultimately become a mature plant. So, ye jo uh, aapne do uh, tane hai, jinko jod kar zameen mein lagaya hai, wo ultimately grow karenge aur wo ek mature plant jo hai, wo ban jayenge. So, here is the picture of grafting. Ye humne kya kiya? Humne ek tana liya aur uske humne, humne ek second jo hai, um, stem usko lagaya and after some time, it will start growing into a new rose plant and it will ultimately have flowers on it. Thik hai, aapko baat samaj mein aarhi hai, ki humne ek tana liya, ठीक है और उसके अंदर हमने दूसरा तना जो है वो अटैच कर दिया ग्राफ्ट कर दिया कुछ टाइम बाद क्या होगा कि उसके अंदर पत्ते निकलने शुरू हो जाएंगे इस नए तने के अंदर पत्ते निकलेंगे और फिर क्या होगा कि उन पत्तों के बाद जो है वो उसके अंदर फ्लारिंग भी स्टार्ट हो जाएगी सो दिस इज कॉल्ड ग्राफ्टिंग ओके लीव ऑफ ब्रायोफेलम ग्रो बेबी प्लांट्स अपॉन दैम ठीक है कुछ प्लांट्स के लीव ऐसे होते हैं जिनके ऊपर नया पौधा जो है वो उग सकता है इसके अलावा पोटैटो के ऊपर बर्ड्स ग्रो करती हैं ये जो है अगर आप इस पूरे पोटैटो को जमीन में लगा दें तो इन बर्ड्स से जो है वो एक नया पौधा जो है वो निकल सकता है ठीक है 
सो पोटैटो बर्ड्स आर एबल टू प्रोड्यूस अ होल न्यू प्लांट इसके लिए आपको सीड की जरूरत नहीं है सो यू जस्ट पुट द पोटैटो बर्ड और द होल पोटैटो इन टू द ग्राउंड एंड इट विल स्टार्ट ग्रोइंग इन टू न्यू पोटैटो सो एलोवेरा एलोवेरा के अंदर उसके लीव्स के अंदर भी ये एबिलिटी है कि इट कैन ग्रो इन टू अ न्यू प्लांट हाउ लेट्स है सीड सो दीज आर द स्मॉल सेक्शन ऑफ एलोवेरा लीव एंड वेन दे आर स्विन इन टू द सॉयल ईच सेक्शन डिवेलप इन टू अ न्यू प्लांट अगर आप इन सेक्शन को जमीन में लगा देंगे तो हर सेक्शन जो है इट इज एबल टू प्रोड्यूस अ न्यू प्लांट ठीक है आप एक ही लीव लें यहां से आपने एक सेक्शन को कट किया और उसके बाद आप उसको छोटे छोटे पोर्शन में कट करें एंड देन put them into the soil aur uske baad kuch time baad aap after few weeks you will notice that each section will grow into a new plant to dekhen ki kis tarike se aloe vera leaves jo hai unme bhi ability hai ki wo new plant mein grow ho sake so supervised activity arrange an exhibition in class ask students to bring two plants or their pictures from each category which grow from seeds and by other parts of the plant and students will demonstrate about reproduction and special features of their plants in the class so my dear students this will be a very healthy activity that you can do in the class teachers uh, i request you all ke aap teacher bachcho ko homework dein ek din pehle ke wo uh, do paudon ki tasveer lekar aaye ek pauda jo hoga wo seed se grow karega jaise ki apple tree hai aur koi dusra pauda lekar aaye jo ke kisi bhi part se jo hai wo produce ho sakta hai jaise ki rose hai it grows from the stem पोटेटो है इट ग्रोज फ्रॉम द बर्ड इसके अलावा एलोवेरा है इट ग्रोज फ्रॉम द लीव तो इस तरीके से बच्चे डिफरेंट प्लांट दो प्लांट्स की पिक्चर लाएंगे वन ग्रोज फ्रॉम सीड एंड वन ग्रो फ्रॉम अदर प्लांट और इसके बाद बच्चे उसको प्रेजेंट करें क्लास में कि किस तरीके से जो है दिस ग्रोज फ्रॉम सीड एंड दिस ग्रोज फ्रॉम द अदर पार्ट ऑफ द प्लांट सो दिस इज हाउ यू कैन कंप्लीट दिस एक्टिविटी नाउ लेट्स मूव फॉरवर्ड दिस इज ग्राफ्टिंग सो देखिए किस तरीके से ग्राफ्ट है यू टेक अ सेक्शन एंड देन यू put it on an other stem and when they join together to wo ek naya plant jo hai uske andar se grow ho sakta hai then through buds these are potato buds and they have the ability to grow into a new potato plant so my dear students now let's move forward towards the evaluation so quickly answer the question do all parts of the plants have the ability to grow into the new plant no uh not all the uh, yes leaves stem roots they all have the ability to grow into a new plant so give some examples of some leaves and stem develop into a new plant a uh, stem of rose plant develops into a new plant uh, aloe vera leaves develop into a new plant so these are the examples of stem and leaves that grow into a new plant okay my dear students uh, now is the time for practice so for practice you can download this worksheet from the description box below this video or you can get it in print form by your teacher so uh, write down your name and your class and then match the following so this is a potato then this is from seed this is grafting and this is from leaf so what you need to do is aapne isko match karna hai so from potato it is bud growing the leaf propagation and uh, this is stem grafting okay so did any item left for matching why give one reason अब कोई ऐसा आइटम है पिक्चर में से जो कि रह गया है यस दिस वन सो व्हाई इट इज लेफ्ट बिकॉज दिस इज ग्रोइंग फ्रॉम एन अदर मॉड दैट इज बाय सीड ओके सो यू विल राइट द रीजन दैट इट इज लेफ्ट बिकॉज इट इज ग्रोइंग फ्रॉम दिस सीड इट इज नॉट ग्रोइंग फ्रॉम एनी अदर पार्ट ऑफ द प्लांट इट इज ग्रोइंग फ्रॉम द सीड सो नाउ लेट्स मूव फॉरवर्ड टू वर्ड्स द होमवर्क सो फॉर होमवर्क यू विल डू क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री और इसका आज आप सेकंड मोड जो है उसको एड्रेस करेंगे थ्रू अदर पार्ट्स इवन ऑन पेज नंबर 127 यू विल कंप्लीट इट इन योर नोटबुक्स एंड यू विल डू एक्टिविटी नंबर टू लेबल द पिक्चर्स गिवन बिलो इन द ऑर्डर टू कंप्लीट द ग्रोथ प्रोसेस सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स यू विल डू दिस एंड टुडे यू विल डू बाय अदर पार्ट फर्स्ट पार्ट हमने कर लिया था नाउ यू विल डू सेकेंड मोड So my dear students I hope you have enjoyed today's lecture now let's move forward towards the wrap up in today's lecture we have learned that some plants have ability to develop into new plant through other parts like stem leaves and buds rose plants can develop by stem grafting potatoes can grow through buds bryophyllum can grow through leaves aloe vera plants can develop by small sections of the leaves 
So my dear students, now you know a lot of things about, uh, about the plants, their seeds, their different parts, and how they reproduce into a new plant. I hope you have enjoyed today's lecture. Keep everybody around you safe. Have a good day. Thank you so much and Allah Hafiz.